All right, here's a video on how I do my bonnets and rags. So here's two days worth of bonnets for us. Um, mixture of cotton and microfiber. Fill up uh, the washing machine. Warm water, deep clean on max. So fill it and then uh, Drop them all. Drop them all in there. Distribute the uh, the weight of the bonnets evenly. Sorry, I wasn't paying attention to the camera. Got some dirty ones, you guys. Dirty, dirty jobs. Look at that. Just throw them all in there. Look at how dirty that one was. Oh. Make sure they get that one in the water. Soaking for a little bit. So that'll fill up quite a ways. A lot. I love these. These mighty bonnets, microfiber, have a thin uh, foam in them. Scrub strips. These things are great, and man, do they hold a lot, a lot of junk. All right, so that's that. So this concoction I got is actually tile cleaner. Uh, it's half Viper Peroxide Powder, Viper or Peroxide Blast, Peroxy Blast. So it's half of that, and it was uh, half free and clear, um, Sager Sauce, free and clear. So it was 50 50. And all it takes that's a two ounce cup. So just put two ounces in there. This is kind of an extra one. So let's do, uh, let's do about three ounces. Three ounces. And those cotton will come out looking great. Uh, a lot of that dirt will just instantly wash out. Of course, the microfiber, it's hard to tell, but those clean up uh, great as well, nice and bright. So I think the key is it's a high pH, and this has got uh, peroxide in it. So a uh, powdered peroxide and a high pH. Um, now they talked about peroxide eating cotton and all that. I haven't seen that happen yet, so not, not an issue with um, with my cotton bonnets whatsoever. So go ahead and uh, give that a whirl. And uh, I mean, you don't have to use Viper. Just uh, get a powdered peroxide and then a high pH and uh, mix up a full tub. So I'm gonna grab a stick and poke that down in there and you'll see just how dirty that water becomes. Hopefully I didn't ruin it by putting the cleaner in yet. I wanted to show you just how dirty that gets. Where does all the soil go? And it hasn't even been soaking or washed that long, so bottoms up. Dirty. Where's all the dirt go? Right into my wife's washing machine. All right, the load is done. Let's take a look. Microfiber. And you know what? I dry them. I do, I dry them all. Cotton. Cleans up nice. It'll be near impossible to fully get rid of some of the soil. But 
man, from what they were, they're a lot brighter. Dry them. Just don't put any softener sheets in there. But so I dry all of this and I will show you why. All right, just got done in the dryer. Look at how nice this looks. Cleans up great. A big old stack. And, uh, even the microfiber towels. I use with the little OP machine. Clean up good. This is why I run them through the dryer. Look at all that lint. The first time you go to use those, you kick them onto a customer's house and you just throw lint balls everywhere. So the dryer pulls that out. It's a lot of lint. It's all stuff from people's carpets still. And we're inside of all the little loops. Crevices. There you have it.